welcome back to Making It Work. And this is a series that I'm doing about my work week makeup. I am choosing one palette, one um, mascara, and one eyebrow um, mascara, I suppose, and um, a different blush for each day. I work four days this week and a different lipstick for each day. So uh, let's get right into it. And this it will go on weekly. Um, I don't know when I'll post these. You know, it'll probably be like the next week. But anyway, let's get into this. Um, the first thing I used, the, the uh, brow gel that I chose for this week is the Anastasia Beverly, Beverly Hills uh, Tinted Brow Gel in brunette and I think this gives me a blonde it looks like it's for blondes or redheads it makes it to you know I'm gonna make it work for this week because I committed to this see it even looks light on there but it says brunette I wish I would have got if I would have got a darker color this would be the perfect um, eye mascara or brow mascara because it goes on so smooth and so nice I really like it but I don't like the color what maybe I'll have to try to do is maybe put a powder on under it maybe um, I'm not sure but it is just it's too light um, from what I can see anyway I kind of went light face and you can tell um, I don't have any pops of color on my face today at all uh, I'm not very happy with my makeup, but I'm in a hurry, so I don't have a lot of time uh, to change anything. The next, um, my mascara I'm going to use this week is the Benefit Roller Lash. And i got to tell you, you know, I have it in the sample size. I'm going to use it all week. It makes my lashes, I mean, you can really tell I got it on. It is so dark, and it even looks like it lengthens a little bit. But it is... Um, it really clumps up my my lashes because the um, one, most of you know what it looks like, most of you have one of these, but it is very small and kind of um, eye-shaped um, wand. And if anybody knows me, you know I kind of like the bigger wands for my eyelashes. I don't know why, it's just easier for me. Okay, so then for my eyes, I am using this week, I'm using the NYX Butt Naked Underneath It All palette. And the colors are absolutely gorgeous in this. What I used today, um, I wish I would have used a darker color because my face just looks kind of ugh. But I used this color here for an all over color, this one. And then I used this peach color up here for my eyeshadow. Um, I wish I would have went like this color and then the peach over it, but I don't have time to change it. Um, and then I, I actually broke this earlier, but I, I figured it out. I got it to work. But this comes with blushes. It comes with um, four blushes and three highlighters. I didn't put any highlighters on, but I used this blush. And it's a real pinky shade. It's really pretty. Um, I don't know if you can even see it. My I my normal um, Real Techniques brush is still wet from me washing it last night. So um, and it doesn't tell me any colors or anything on anything. But this is this just slides out and I it slides so hard that I pulled it all the way out. <laughs> you can tell I'm in a hurry. Okay, and then for lipstick I used my Mac. Um, 10. Now, I'm not real sure. I did not get this from MAC or from Ulta or anything. I got it online. So I'm pretty sure this is probably counterfeit. I'm not real sure. I got I got 10 of them at once um, one time, and they've all got numbers on them. So that kind of makes me think that this is not true MAC. But anyway, they they are still very creamy. They last quite a while. Um, they're very pretty. So, you know, I really don't care. Anyway, it's Lady Gaga by MAC. And this is the color. Isn't that pretty? Just a really pretty nude. The kind of nude that suits me. It, you know, it isn't too light to wash me out. It's got a little pink in it. 
But this is the nude, kind of nude that I like, the pinky nudes. But anyway, that will go right there so I don't use it again this week. And anyway, I'm going to do this every week. Um, I've done it two weeks so far. And I hope I you guys have a you. wonderful day. And um, be happy. And I will see you Wednesday. Hi, Bye -bye. everybody, and welcome back to day two. Today is Wednesday, the second day in my work week, and this is week three. So anyway, three. let's get into this, into today's makeup. This week, I am using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Tinted Brow Gel in Brunette, which is kind of a funny brunette. It's really light for light brunettes, which I, I don't consider myself light brunette, so it looks funny on my eyes I think but I'm going to continue to use it because Anastasia with Beverly Hills <laughs> excuse me then for my mascara I'm using the roller lash by Benefit um, this makes my lashes look pretty good but you kind of have to work at it because it clumps it's a very clumpy mascara as far as I'm concerned um, tell me what you think it even on the, oh, well, now it's not going to do it, but this is the wand, and even down here it was really clumpy, and it's not that, not very old, so I don't know. Um, for my eyeshadows today, I used this as a base, which I will probably use every day, and then I used this as an eyeshadow. It's brown with uh, gold sparkles in it. And then I topped it with this just to make it so it wasn't quite so dark. But, you know, I think I need to go a little bit darker because everything is so, it really makes me look pale and washed out if I don't. So I, I can't really get away with the light eyeshadows, I don't think. Okay, so for my blush today, I used the second one since today's day two, very pretty mauve color. And then I topped it um, and put a little bit of this on my highlight. Um, it's the, the more pinker one uh, highlight. I haven't been closing this all the way because I don't want to break it again. And then for my lipstick, I used my MAC uh, Lady Gaga. And this is uh, color 02. Now, um, I'm pretty sure these are not real MAC lipsticks because I got them cheaper than a MAC lipstick would cost. Um, give me below your, your thoughts on that, whether you think it's harmful, you, you, know, you think it's a shame to not use the real thing. You know, some people are on a budget, and I wanted a MAC lipstick, and this looks pretty real to me, except for the number at the bottom. That's what kind of tells me that this probably isn't real. But, you know, I've used this for a year. It doesn't really look like it much, but <laughs> I have used it quite a few times. And I haven't gotten any cold sores. I haven't gotten herpes. I haven't gotten mouth cancer, whatever, from this. So um, I think it's a pretty good lipstick. I like it. So tell me what you think. Uh, my hair, speaking of my hair, my bangs are getting way too long. They're... They're too long to hang down because they go down to here now. And I cannot stand them in my eyes. So I've been pushing them over. I don't know what I want to do if I want to cut them or if I want to let them grow. Let me know what you think. And speaking of my, let me, let me show you my makeup first of all. Look how blotchy I am. I have restless leg syndrome. So I have been on Ropinerol, um, which is the generic of, I can't think of what it's called right now, but it's the main drug for Parkinson's disease. Um, that's the drug I have to take for three, four years. I can't afford it. So I have been stretching it out as far as I possibly can between uses. And it had been a week since I used it last night. I knew I would not get a bit of sleep if I didn't use it. So I took the pill. Let, I did. It makes me sick. 
I have been sick all day. Just not not physically fit, sick, but just I where I want to sleep, where I just don't feel good. I have you know less energy than normal, which isn't much, isn't saying much, but I just don't feel good. And um, I've noticed today I'm really blotchy. I have noticed. Remember that necklace that I had on? I showed you. If you can see that, it broke me completely out. We're in it. I've had it on for a week, and it hasn't bothered me a bit. Last now today, it's it's hurting me. So I had to take it off. This is the necklace right here. It's gorgeous, but I guess I'll just have to wear it sparingly. I mean, you know, not everybody wears their necklaces for a week. I I'm just lazy that way. Um, but I've noticed. Uh, once in a while I get blotchy, but I've really noticed it today with, especially up here, look at that, how blotchy I am. Um, my eyes are red. My, I don't know, it's hot in here too, I'm sweating. Let me put my glasses on so I can see. Clean them a little bit, they're filthy as usual. <laughs> but... Um, anyway, every time I take it lately, I don't feel good. But there are very few choices. This medicine is over $100 a month, which I there's no way I can do it. Um, so I've got a week's worth left. So I'm going to make it stretch. But the other option, you know, they, they gave me a prescription for another, another pill. But that's $200 a month. I don't know how, how these pharmaceutical companies, they make it so you can't afford to be to feel better because you can't afford to be on the medicine. And even if I had insurance, that would still, you know, it would be the high end of my insurance, you know, of my copay, which I, I wish I had insurance. You know, I would, you know, I, maybe it's because I don't take it often enough. But I, I don't quite understand it. I have to talk to my doctor, but then again, you know, <laughs> same old, same old stuff from me. Anyway, um, I'm on my way to work. If I can find my watch. Yes, it's 10 after 4. I've got to go. I've got to go to the post office, and then I've got to go to work. So I will... Talk to you Friday. Bye-bye. Hi, guys. This is Connie back with day three of my Making It Work series. I'm going to get right into my makeup, and then I've got some news for you. Um, today I used, or this week I am using my um, Roller Lash by Benefit. Mascara. My Anastasia Beverly Hills Tinted Brow Gel in Brunette. I'm hurry and I'm sorry I used I'm gonna use this until it's gone because it is you know like here so I'm gonna finish this this is my Ulta eye primer I got advice from somebody to start using this all the time so I'm going to uh, for my eyes I use today my eyes look like crap again I uh, I just cannot make a good look this week um, I use this for, whoops, this for all over my eyes. I use this dark gold for my base color, or for my main eyelid color. And then I, I colored in the, the, the V with this dark brown with, and it's got sparkles. So, um, but I don't, uh, I don't think it looks good. <laughs> but then I use this third color. It's more, it's like a peachy with sparkles in it little tiny gold sparkles in it and again I use this pink highlighter just because it's there to use and I used number 11 in my Mac um, Lady Gaga and it is this color it's just a really light pinky nude and I really like it really like that color okay that is it for my makeup Just my hair will not cooperate lately. That towel does not help at 
and it being so humid it is really my hair is just super wet I'm gonna have to start blow drying it even though I've got curl in it yet and I don't really want to but I'm gonna have to because towel drying it is not cutting it so anyway I got a job I start the 24 the 24th I go for training the 25th they open their doors it's a brand new restaurant uh, bar casino in our town which you know isn't a huge town but it's a it's called the lake house it's right across from our lake so it's going to be really pretty views and stuff but the casino i'm going to be the casino person um where i work 2 30 in the afternoon until 10 30 at night uh it's full time i don't know what kind of benefits since it's you know a cafe but it's ten dollars an hour which is really good compared to you know what usual waitresses and stuff get which i'm not really a waitress I, i'll be serving drinks and stuff to the people in the in the casino but um that's it but i finally got a job i am beyond thrilled you know it's not the kind of job i wanted it really isn't but i think it's going to be fun and I, you know fun for me and i haven't had fun for a long time <laughs> so it's time to have a little bit of fun and I think that it will be fun getting to know people you know being out amongst people I like doing that kind of stuff so that's my big news um, I've told you know a lot of you that watch me I've told you on Facebook and that but I wanted to come on here today and tell you I, I went for an interview yesterday I really gotta go but um, I went for she called me as I was pulling into the grocery store. I just had a, a t-shirt and shorts, jean shorts on. And she says, can you come for an interview? And I says, I'm not dressed for an interview. But she said, that's okay. This place is a mess. They're renovating. And to come anyway. So I went out there. We chatted for a little bit. She hired me on the spot. I am just beyond thrilled. So anyway, I do have to go. I'm sorry. I'm in such a hurry. Um, I dawdled when I should have doodled or something today <laughs> i'll talk to you in my next video hello Bye -bye. and welcome back to day four the last day of my work week and this is making it work so if you like this kind of thing please stay okay, tuned okay so we are ready to go uh today is um my last full week i work monday and wednesday next week and then um I'm off until the 24th when I start my new job. I may work the Monday after next week. I am not real sure yet. Um, depending on if they need me or not, I will work it. But other than that, um, I'm taking a week off because I'm going to have a rummage sale, try to get rid of some of this garbage around here, <laughs> this excess stuff around here. And once that's done maybe i'll make enough money where i can do a few swaps or something you know so anyway let's get into our last day of this week first thing i did was um i'll give you my thoughts this is my final thoughts on these items here um this is the anastasia by Bever uh, beverly hills uh brow mascara in uh brunette and that's what that looks like show you what the wand looks like I haven't showed you that all week you know and you would think that this is too long but um, I'll tell you my my final thoughts on this this is awesome the only thing I really dislike about this is the color I need a darker color this is too too blondish brown too light brunette for me um, you'd think brunette would be you know a little bit darker than this but it is really light so it is just too light but it goes on like a dream it goes on better than any of my other brow mascaras i love this wand and it is so soft and so smooth going in and out of here um the bristles are so soft i i love this except for the color i wish i could just exchange it but i can't so anyway on to my next item which is my um, I used my Ulta eye primer and I'm going I'm not going to use any other until this is gone it's about half gone I'm gonna use this up and I've decided I'm gonna use this every time I do my eye makeup so all right um, and I this week I was using the NYX butt naked underneath it all palette 
and I, I like these palettes that do it all. They do um, blush and highlight and um, eyeshadow, of course. But anyway, here is the eyeshadows that I use today. And I use this as normal. I always use, you know, just the plain base, matte base, usually matte um, base. And then I used this color today. And it's got tiny gold sparkles. It is absolutely beautiful. And it turned out really pretty on my eyes, too, I think. Okay. So that was my eyeshadow. And I used the last blush in the palette today which is uh, really like a, a matte peach and then I topped it off with the pinky highlighter so it's not real noticeable on my bare skin blush is really hard for me to get to show up um, where it's not patchy or that if I want it to show up really nice I have to use foundation which I don't do when I'm working so Plus, it's getting into the hot months, and I sweat so darn bad. <laughs> All right, so this is done with. And then I used, oh, <clears throat> there's a couple of the shadows in here that I thought were a little patchy. This one here is fine. This one here is fine. I thought this was really patchy, um, this peachy color one. This went on like a dream. Uh, but overall, they're good, good eyeshadows. Okay, the blush went on fine, and the highlighter is beautiful. So I have no complaints there at all. All right. The next thing I used was my roller lash by Benefit. I I am on the fence about this. Um, oops. This is a a mini size, of course. It's easy to apply, but you have to go over and over and over it to really make it nice and, and pretty because it's clumpy. So it, all in all, I think it looks nice. The end product looks nice, but it takes a lot of work to get it to, to really, so it's not clumpy. All right. The next thing I used was my last... Um, one for this week, my MAC by Lady Gaga, and this is number 05, and it's a really pretty light pinky nude. Most of them were that way this week, but this is, this is more pink than any of the other ones, but it is so pretty. Okay, so that is my last day for my making it work of this week, and next week, like I said, is my last full week, or it's just three days. But um, I will still do this next week, and I will continue to do it with my new job. I have no idea how many days I'm going to work. I'm assuming four days a week um, is what I'm kind of assuming. Um, 32 to 40 hours is what I'm going to get. So 32 is would probably, I'm, I'm thinking, be my normal. And then if somebody wanted a day off, I, would, I could pick up another day to make it 40. <clears throat> so, yay. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, I'm very leery. I'm always very leery on a new job because <clears throat> the last few years, jobs just have not worked out for me. I've worked a lot of jobs in my life. And the last few years, it just seems that, you know, I'll work a few months and I'm either let go or... Um, my job ends because it was temporary or something, you know, that just doesn't work. And so I'm very leery, you know. We're, we're not a big city. We're, I can't remember how big we are. Um, I'd have to look that up. But we're not a big city. We're, um, if anybody knows South Dakota at all, anybody has been to the Corn Palace, you kind of know what I'm talking this, about. This new business is a like a steakhouse, restaurant, um, a bar, and a casino. And I'm a casino attendant, uh, the casino person, where I would, um, you know, um, take money for them. I would uh, give them payouts. I would take them drinks, stuff like that, so they don't have to get up from their machines. But it's not like Vegas, you know, where 
your job is pretty secure. This here is, you know, like I said, not a big town. I don't know if there's... I'm, I'm a little nervous, let's put it that way. But it's just new job nerves, you know. It's... Um, I'm sure it'll work out fine, but, you know, I'm just nervous. I, I don't want to be in this situation again, like I have been since January. Just scrimping and saving and asking for help. And, you know, I've had I've made some wonderful friends since then. You know, a lot of people care about me that I really didn't didn't think would ever happen. Um, got pretty low self-esteem. So, um, excuse me. <laughs> um, I say I'm um, an awful lot. <laughs> but I've made a lot of really good friends and I've some people have helped me so much since I got you know into this fix and I, I have a hair I appreciate it more than I could ever say more than I could ever say you have saved my life I would be out I know that I could probably go to my mom's if I had to but boy she wouldn't like it and I don't want to live with her again. Mm -mm -mm. I'm 60 years old. I do not want to live with my mommy. Besides, she drives me crazy. <laughs> so anyway, I will talk to you all uh, tomorrow with the brand new week. And if you like this kind of thing, give me a thumbs up. And I love you all. And I'll talk to you tomorrow.